What's going on boys? Welcome everybody back to another video, another objectives guide. This man has got a special place in my heart, lads. I used his Rule Breakers card for over 600 and 50 games and I was doing a forfeit wheel on Twitch and I had to discard him my club legend Dante I've even got my own Twitch sub emote on him and lads he has returned he has evolved a team of a season at Dante objective let's get into the objective guide before we get into today's video lads if you guys want to check out my Davis plays clips channel that'll be much appreciated the links will be in the description majority of the clips are taken from my twitch channel they range from maybe 20 seconds to a minute long icon packs 84 times 25 packs and all of that good stuff make sure to drop it a sub lads and enjoy the video so if you guys are new to these objective guides, essentially what we do, we go over all new objectives EA release, whether they're pack objectives, player objectives, or so on and so forth. We go through them one by one, giving you guys my tips along the way. For the most anticipated part of the video, we build you guys a squad that you can use to complete this card. Now the squad's not going to be the most godly like squad. The whole point of a squad builder is going to be a cheap, affordable, maybe around 35 to 40,000 coins for the casual players that maybe do not have, uh, you know, know insane league on players in their squad or a high coin value or a coin amount then we'll obviously make that squad for you guys to copy to give you a relatively usable team that you can use without further ado boys let's get started as well if necessary we will have some in-game examples pop up on the screen now score 15 goals in the live foot friendly league on lineup we'll go have a look at the league on lineup shortly but that's very self-explanatory assist four goals with defenders in the live foot friendly which we'll get into in a second win four matches in the live foot friendly league on lineup and score in 10 separate matches in the live foot friendly league on lineup so this looks relatively easy very similar to Ansu Fati's objectives this like this looks like it could take you genuinely pick or take maybe an hour to complete if you do golden goal which we will touch on the golden goal rule in a second the league on lineup game mode is a classic match uh you got seven days to complete it so you've got the whole week of league on tots to complete it you need exactly 18 league on uber eats players so that's the starting 11 and the seven players on the bench you need at least five clubs and exactly five countries or regions and you can only have at most one lone player so if you do it if you do get a league on tots lone player maybe then it would probably be best to use him obviously assuming you stay within the country's limit so let's just get into the squad builder we need at least five clubs and exactly five countries so lads this is a squad we have come up with probably going to come in at around 35 to 40 thousand coins a little disclaimer some of these players are out of packs ben yet has got a team of a season uh paquette has got a team of a season and i believe new Minch has got a team of a season so if you guys do want to buy these players buy them as soon as possible because they are only going to keep rising now this is a squad builder we have used we've got at least five clubs we've got Lille, we have got monaco we have got leon um we have got PSG and we do have uh, OGC Nice so we've got at least five clubs and we have got exactly five nations we've got France we've got Portugal we have got Brazilian and we have got Belgium and Algeria so that is going to tick off the at least five clubs we've got exactly five clubs as well coincident coincidentally but we've got ex at least five clubs and exactly five nations which once again going back to it as you can see uh, you've got at least five clubs exactly five nations perfecto now you've got the full league on team and happy days you just need 18 players right you need 18 players to get into a game this is your starting 11 so you need to fill up the bench with some more league on players search your club for league on players to chuck on the bench if you've got some good players like this obviously you'd want to be starting a neymar marquinhos new and Menge. Once again, for the sake of a video, though, we're not going to do that. But if you've even got some gold commons or some silver league on players, simply chuck them on the bench. And if you do not, then you can simply search the transfer market for some league on players and just fill the bench up. Happy days. You do not have to use them. They don't have to be good. They are just there to tick off the at least or exactly 18 league on players requirement to play the game mode. Now, heading into tip number one or two, if you count the squad builder as a tip, is going to be a golden goal. Now, golden goal, basically, in other words, first goal wins. Now, golden goal in this game mode is 100% viable. You do not have to do it because I know you need defender assists as well, which we will touch on how you can get those defender assists easily as well in a second. 
Um, but golden goal is basically an unspoken community rule. If you score first, your opponent is going to pause and quit. And if you concede first, you'll pause and quit. After you get the defender assist or something like that, it may be best you've got the hardest objective out of the way. It may be best you just do golden goal from that point onwards. Now, if you want to do golden goal from that point onwards, and if you are going to do golden goal, simply change your team name to golden goal. So when your opponent lines up, he'll see your team name and he'll be like, oh, sweet, this dude's going to be doing golden goal. I'm going to do the same. Happy day. So make sure your team name is golden goal. Now, heading back on over to the squad that we are using. We are using a 4-3-3 formation. We've got Jonathan Bamba at left mid, Ben Yedda at striker, Jelson Martins at right mid, with a midfield free of Renato Sanchez, Lucas Piquetta, and Hussein Awa. Left back, we've got Noon Mench, who's originally a left wing back, Kimpembe and Denea as our two centre backs. Right back, we've gone for Atal, and in net, we have gone for Lopez. Happy days, boys. This is looking a very, very solid team as well in, in a very slight chance that you cannot get into a game because um, EA might count the exactly five nations for the bench as well then you'll just simply want to have a full French bench because then obviously that rhymes you'd want to have a full French bench or a full bench of players from France because obviously that will keep the exactly five nations but just a heads up they don't clarify it the bench should not count towards the exactly five nations if they do just have a full bench of gold common players from France there will be no issue whatsoever now heading on over to the defender's assist. Now the defender assist is relatively simple and there's a reason we've gone for the 4-3-3 formation here. Now the 4-3-3 formation is a beautiful formation for this game mode because you've got a solid midfield, your defense is good as anything, but what you're going to want to do is chuck a pause straight away and if you haven't got your defender assist yet, what you're going to want to do is move your right back a towel up to right wing and your left back or left wing back for that matter, Nguyen Minj up to left wing because that means that obviously you're going to be playing right wing and left wing in game and assisting from the right wing or left wing position is going to be a whole lot easier than it would be assisting from the left back or right back position. So my tip for the defender assist is simply just to move him up in game and you are good to go. Now lads, we're going to head on over to the footbin view here um, and tip number three is going to be none other than chemistry styles. Now obviously we can see the whole new league on tots looking absolutely saucy. Lionel Messi, Ben Yedda for Fana, Gwen Doozy. This is looking an absolutely sensational team, isn't it? That's looking unreal. Salib is cheap as anything as well. Very, very solid team. Um, anyway, we're getting sidetracked. Now, chemistry styles. Let's take, actually, no, Bamba, because Bamba's going to be playing left back in game if you need to defender assist, so we won't use him as an example. Let's use Gold Rear, Ben Yedda as an example. Now, as I said, he'll be starting to rise in price because he is currently out of packs. As you can see, he is currently 7,000 coins on the PlayStation, 9k on the Xbox, so try get him before he does uh, go, you know, fully extinct. Now, Chemistry Styles and the Beauty of Footbin, I'm not sponsored by them at all. I'm simply just using them as an example, so shout out to Footbin. But you can try out different Chemistry Styles on different players and it will boost their stats and performance in game. For example, Ben Yedda with a basic chemistry style is an 87 rated striker as you can see, but if you were to chuck on a marksman or something like that, he goes to an 89 rated striker in game. Gets a plus 8 shooting, plus 9 dribbling, and plus 9 physical. Let's say a sniper makes him an 86 rated striker, a hawk will make him an 87, exact same as a basic. Um, so because obviously with a basic chem style, which is a, the basic chem style you get with any card, they're still going to get a little boost in game. So I feel like for Ben Yedda, the smartest one would be probably a marksman for him because it does put him up an extra two ratings than he usually would be with that basic chemistry style. Gives him some great shooting, some exceptional dribbling and a little bit of a physical boost. You don't have to go and buy Hunters and Shadows for your whole team, but I just think if you do have some chemistry styles lying around in your club, it would be best to use them. So now that we've got basically all of that sorted, we'll just recap over the objectives one more time for good luck. Team of Season Dante score 15 goals. Um, you will probably find the game, and if you are doing Golden Goal for the 10 games, you'll still be left with 5 goals to get, assuming every single player you match does Golden Goal, which will be unlikely. Um, but with this one, you could simply offside trap, maybe let your opponent get some goals, get let each other get 
get the assist happy days and then you can just play on from like 10 10 or something like that if you do want to go down that route a little bit of a bonus tip for you lads you can chuck your opponent a message and say hey man if you let me score 10 goals I'll do the same for you and you can get your defender assist that way now assist four goals with defenders as I said moving your right back and left back up to right wing and left wing in game the win four matches and scoring 10 separate matches will come naturally but naturally even more fast if you're doing golden goal lads good luck I'm 100% getting this card done Dante is going to be home soon Dante will be home soon I'm looking forward to it lads hope you guys enjoy and I'll see you guys later